Antigua and Barbuda Tourism Authority and the Antigua Cruise Port welcomed the return of the ferry on Saturday. The passengers disembarked the vessel to steel pan music, dancers and stilt walkers. Antigua and Barbuda Tourism Authority Chief Executive Officer Colin James and Director of Operations and Projects at Global Ports, Elroy Skerritt, welcomed Captain Olivier Fedor and his passengers to our shores. We just want to extend a very, very warm welcome to our um, guests from Guadeloupe. Um, Captain told me they took two hours to get over here this morning, bringing 415 passengers, and that's good news to our ears. This is a fitting way as we wind down Tourism Week. I just want to uh, give you a special invitation to, to basically participate in what we have to offer, the hospitality uh, of our people, uh, the culture, uh, etc. Alright, so once again, welcome to Antigua and Barbuda, welcome to the Antigua Cruise Port, and uh, we look forward to return visits. The CEO of the Tourism Authority also announced that Saturday's ferry service will not be the last of his voyage as it will arrive again in the new year. This ferry service will be coming back again in, in April, in May and in August, summer of next year. So we look forward to growing this business because it's, it's great to connect. Antigua and Barbuda has always been a regional hub via air and we hope to also have that be a regional hub via sea as well. The captain and his management team were presented with tokens of appreciation by the Tourism Authority. The captain thanked everyone involved for their welcome. I say thank you for the um, the um, what is the name? Hospitality, the warm yeah. welcome. Hospitality, and um, I'm very happy to come in to come back to Antigua. Sasha Dean for ABS News.